Let us solve a very interesting problem. This question says that in a test of 30 questions, so there are total number of 30 questions. Let us write it down. Total questions equal to 30. There are 4 positive marks for each correct answer. So let us write CA that is correct answer is equal to plus 4. That is for each correct answer we are getting plus 4 marks and minus 2 marks for each wrong answer. So let us say wrong answer is WA and we are getting minus 2 marks for each wrong answer. Julia attempts all questions. Okay, so she answers all these 30 questions out of which 19 are correct. Okay, so correct correct answers are 19 and wrong answers is equal to 30 minus 19. This is equal to 11. So Julia has answered 19 correct answers and uh, wrong answers were 11. Now the questions are how many marks Julia has scored in the exam. So as per uh, you know whatever we have written here. So for correct answer there are plus 4 marks. So correct answers 19. So correct answers is equal to 19. So marks in correct answer is equal to 19 multiplied by 4. 19 multiplied by 4 is 76. And wrong answers. She has got 11 wrong answers. Marks in wrong answer w a is equal to 11 multiplied by minus 2 because he has because as per the rule there are minus 2 marks for each wrong answer 11 multiplied by minus 2 is minus 22 now we need to find out what is the total score he has got so total score will be total marks is equal to marks in marks in correct answer plus marks in wrong answer this is equal to 76 plus minus 22 76 plus minus 22 is 54 because when we add a negative integer then we need to move right on the number line as per the number line rule so 76 plus minus minus 22 is 76 minus 22 which is 54. So this is the total score Julia has got in her exam. Thank you for watching.